Brain Tech here, where tech is made simple. So on the channel, we've been talking about Microsoft's new AI Explorer, which is basically going to be a souped up version of Copilot that will be rolling out uh, in this year's annual feature update, Windows 11 24H2. And we've also been speaking about the possible system requirements for AI Explorer in Windows 11 24H2. And I'll leave a video I posted on those system requirements in the end screen and then one I posted yesterday on AI Explorer if you would like some more info, if you'd like to play catch up regarding that new feature. Now, as mentioned in a previous video, possible strings had been spotted by Albacore over on X in an earlier preview build in the Canary Channel, build 26100. And just a quick recap, because it does pertain to today's video, the possible system requirements to be able to run AI Explorer will be processor architecture ARM64, at least 16 gigabytes of RAM, some of all Windows drive partition sizes, at least 225 gigabytes, and checks for presence of Snapdragon X Elite A380 NPU, which is a neural processing unit, which is needed, according to Microsoft, to um, determine if your PC is an AI PC or not an AI PC, according to Microsoft. Now, in regards to uh, the system requirements to be able to run AI File Explorer, Albacore over on X once again has uh, spotted some bits and pieces once again under the hood in last week's Canary Channel build 26200, where it seems now that AI Explorer will check the requirements um, that are needed, and if they are not met, a warning will be present in its overlay so basically that means that that warning could be a possible system requirements not met watermark displaying um in and on the pc somewhere so we hope we will be able to turn that watermark off though if your pc like mine is not an ar pc which i think most users pcs at this stage are not ar pcs so as mentioned um it seems according to microsoft and those strings spotted that um ARM64 CPUs and at least 16 gigabytes of memory will be set as the recommendation for the AI File Explorer. And it's going to be interesting to see how this all rolls out because obviously, as mentioned, most users, including myself, don't have an AI PC with a neural processing unit or an ARM64 um, CPU. So how I've said and how I've suggested is I think Microsoft will roll out the so-called full package if you have an AI PC with AI File Explorer and the works. And if you don't, then obviously you will get um, most and some of the AI features that will be rolling out with Windows 11 24H2 later this year. But nonetheless, as I get bits and pieces of this info, just putting it out there, if you would be interested, because I know a lot of you are following the annual feature update rolling out later this year. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.